Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. No, 9.51 p.m. June 5th, 2023. I'm here with my nephew, Calvin, and we're in Seward, Alaska. This is our first trip this year to go do some snagging. Last couple days, the fishers, the Red Seven, have, are just pulling in right now. One couple, they just left the parking lot and they limited out. I didn't ask how long they were, but we're here today. This is the Nash Bay Front campground which is next to the one that we were here last year on the other side right there so we're gonna go check it out this place is really nice it's only ten dollars per day but they run um that couple just they just told us that it was free today and tomorrow but we didn't know about that but it's all good they got restroom beach access there's the access point right here parking lot you got to see all people right over there so it's a good geez i want to say one mile walk so make sure you guys have your backpacks. You guys can see I have my backpacks. We got hooks, simple stuff, very simple. Beautiful, beautiful man, midnight sun. The sun's not gonna set till 11, but even after 11 midnight, it's still gonna be uh, pretty nice. But there's a lot of folks. There's not that many folks, but there's a good amount of folks. It is a Monday night, guys. It's a Monday night. <coughs> We're gonna go follow the crowd, see how it is at the crowd. And after that, we'll wander off into the ocean. It is low tide right now. We missed the outgoing tide uh, about two and a half, three hours ago, but it's all good. I think there's still a good amount of fish in here. All right, guys, we're right here where the crowd is. This is one of the main creeks. So everyone's going far out. We're gonna go far out, man. That's where the fish is. Look at all the carcass, guys. Lots of fish. Everyone got fish on their stringer, guys. There's fish everywhere. But I think we might have missed the rush. We're going all the way to the ocean now. Let's see what's over here. 10 on 9 p.m. guys. We've been casting for the last 20, 20 casts already. Uh, people are catching it, but not super hot yet. Guys, fish on. Fish on, fish on, guys. First fish. First fish, first fish. Look at that. Woo! 18. Oh, it's off. Oh, well, that's the one they lost down there. They lost that one down there and they came down towards me. That thing's a big one. And the bloodiness. First fish within uh Second fish, guys. Second fish. 1022. 1022. These things are big. Oh, these guys are big. These guys are big, Calvin. We didn't bring the fish walker. Oh, guys. Two fish within uh, 10 minutes. Just keep walking back. Keep walking back. Slowly, slowly. Calvin got his. Calvin got it. Good job. Okay, you do it. Bleed it out, do the thing. All right, uh, 1031, Calvin got his first. Yeah, his first fish. Shove it through the gills like that and come up the mouth. Damn, they're big. They're all nice colors too. Teach you. Came off, it's okay. Kevin just lost his second. Okay, keep fishing. They're right there. They're over there. You're doing something, right? Calvin, look, remember, don't reel when you're doing this. Pull up and then reel going down. Pull up and go down like that, okay? 10.37 p.m. I think the fishes are a little bit further out than what we're casting to because my nephew here, he's casting it out and I'm just doing a sling method. I'm doing the Kenai sling. So I think they're in like the middle of that run right there. People to the right of me are catching too, but they're further out, they're further away from the right. My nephew, he's been casting it because he's he's used to the casting method instead. Oh, there it is, right there, right there, right there. Slowly, slowly. There we go. Third fish, third fish. This one's a bit small. But we got it. Look at that. Oh, this one's big actually. See? Keep going, keep going, Calvin. They're over there. They're coming up. This one has a a what? This one has a pretty nice gnarly tail in. Alright. There he goes. This is my third. Calvin got one. 
Yeah, Kyle, I think they're kind of in the middle. Uh, five fish, yeah. This is my fourth fish, guys. Fourth fish. Uh, 1044. Yeah. We brought the fish wonker, but it's in the car. 1046, guys. 1046. I got four. My nephew got one. It's pretty slow right here, but it's uh, it's nice and steady when they swim up. <laughs> there we go. Oh, there we go. All right, guys, fifth fish, fifth fish. There it is. All right, this is the fifth. Nice and chromey. This one's a bit smaller than the other ones. But you guys can see right there, they're nice. Oh, hurry, they're in there. Help. Calvin, they're in there. Calvin, hurry. Get them. Start throwing in there. You got to do my technique, Calvin. Uh, 10.53 guys, 10.53 p.m. We're still under the one hour mark. We started, finish, started fishing at 1, now oh, 10. Man. Calvin got one, 11 a.m., no 11 p.m. Walk back, keep rolling, keep rolling, go, go, go. Slowly, slowly. Good job, get it, get it, get it. There you go, Calvin. Second fish for Calvin. All right, you do your thing. All right, guys, six fish. Six, six, six. Look at that. Look at that beauty. Woo! Oh, we should have brought a bigger swing stringer. Current time is 11.06 p.m. I got six so far. My nephew got two. And we're on proxy right now. You got one. Neighbor got one. Yeah, guys, the tide's coming up soon. Yeah, that's why the fishes are moving in right now. Everyone's catching left to right over there where that guy the yellow shirt is. That's a good spot right now, but Dang, everyone's catching. Okay, you stay here, Calvin. I'm gonna go right there. I'm gonna go right there. If it's good, I'll, I'll call you over, okay? It's a battle war right here. I don't want to bring my nephew over here. Oh, oh there it is, right there. Fish on. Fish on. Oh, shit. Calvin, come over here. Come right here. <laughs> I was gonna walk down there and I got one right here. Fish on. Hard to land it though. I lost that one. It's hard to land, guys. We're in the water right now. Yeah, it's hard to land right now, guys. You gotta walk like... Oh, it's hot right now. There it is, right there. Oh, it's smoke. Fishes are jumping right in front of us. Right there, fish on. Yeah, 
Very, oh, lost that one again. We're losing the fish, guys. Damn, everyone's getting it right here. There it is, right there. Oh. Oh. oh my god, there's so much fish. This is hard to land on. Yep, tide's coming in. Dude, how many you get? You got one? All right, over oh, there's a lot of fish, but it's too hard. You cannot make the water. All right, guys, tide's coming up, guys. 11.17. Fish on for this girl right here. Okay, cast right here, Calvin. Everyone's catching right now, guys. Uh, 11.20. These two ladies next to me, they're catching. 11.33 p.m. We got seven more fish to grab. Tide's coming up right now. Everyone's catching it left, hot and right. Left and right, way over there. We're way down there, but the tide's coming up, so we're trying to move forward. But man, this is a lot of fish to carry. We only brought one stringer, so hopefully we can fit seven more in there. Or else I'll have to start flaying them right now and put them in the backpack. But everyone's still catching down there. Fish hasn't gone up, got up to here yet. Man, it is nice out here. Lots of fish. It's starting to sprinkle right now, so we're gonna try to catch whatever we can right now. If we get whatever we don't get, we're just gonna call it a night. Fun stuff. Just caught his right here, 11.38. He did it all by himself. Good job, good job. Just bleed it out. Come on, fish on. 11.42, 11.42. Uh, oh. All right, guys, we're good. Oh. This is a big one. Look at that. Go. Walk back, walk back. Watch your hook. Watch your hook behind you. Kelvin got it. Up, up, up. Lift up the rod. There we go. Woo! <laughs> Good job. Welcome back, everyone. It's currently 5.42 a.m. Didn't get to film the outro for the video. Uh, we started fishing at 10 p.m. We pretty much caught our limit by midnight. I ended up getting my limit, my nephew got his limit, and then I was able to get five for my proxy. So we got a total of 17. We could have got one more, but then um, it was midnight by that time, and the tide was coming up pretty fast. And we had to like, well, at least for me and my nephew, we had to like really push it. It was getting dark. We were hauling 17 fish, super crazy. Uh, my fish, I just went ahead and gut them, chop the head chop the tails same as my proxy and then my nephew i flay his so i can throw that into his backpack so he can carry it uh but so didn't get to film any of that but it went pretty good it was still really really hot when the tide was still coming in people were still catching it left to right but it was getting dark um it was getting dark it was starting to sprinkle and the weather was starting to get pretty bad it was getting cloudy overcast and i didn't want to risk my nephew being out there in that weather condition but we got plenty of fish i forgot how heavy 17 fish was but we were able to haul it back by the time we got to the parking lot it was completely pitch black not completely pitch black but it was probably dark midnight um got on the road at 1 a.m we drove for about an hour and then pulled off to the side of the road slept for an hour to get some rest and then we finally got home about 30 minutes ago i just got done flaying the fish so this is my these are my fish this is my last one you can see they're really nice <laughs> nice in colors this year and really nice size really good size um, fish so i'm gonna go ahead and flay my fish um, clean out my proxy uh, my proxy fish and then deliver that to my proxy and that's pretty much it guys so i we'll hope you guys enjoyed this trip this won't be the last trip for the year i'm definitely gonna go back down there because it's super hot this is just the beginning of the week and I think this run here is going to last for a good two weeks. So we're probably going to make another trip back out there. And this time, I'm not going to do a, a late night run anyways. Uh, this is super last minute with my wife's schedule. 
Um, but the next run, we're going to go during the daytime so you guys can get some better footage. And also, we'll have more time to be out there. And hopefully, the weather is more nicer. So, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next time, next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>